You play Gridley or Footy Grid? Yeah. I've been Gridley. <laughs> what the oh, fuck? Gonna, yeah, right. Let's do it. Absolutely. <laughs> What's Gridley? You kidding? No. You'll love this. You'll love this. Where do I type this? Type it in the search bar, gridley.com.au. You have to match up. You have nine guesses and you've got to match up a player that fits the criteria for both X axis and Y axis. So okay. Geelong and Port Adelaide. So someone who has played at least one game for Geelong and one game for Port Adelaide. And you want to get the most obscure one for your score yeah, for the more the unique the player, the better. The better score, yeah. Okay. Maybe the other one's better. I don't know. Um, we can keep. We can do a Carlton based one. I would have no. Yeah. I'd be terrible at this either way. No, no, you won't. No, no, I'm telling you. I, I, my general knowledge of AFL is fucked. I don't know about that. I'm telling you. Like, I'll back you in, bro. <laughs> There's no point. They go for me. So hang on. So you got Gary Ablett. Oh, oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. Come on, Carlton man. Fans. <laughs> Sam Cranage. <laughs> <laughs> Sam Cranage top it in. Of all That'll the, get a good score. Dude, of all the Sam, Sam Cranage. Of all the players it could have been. Sam Cranage. <laughs> just just for the record, yeah. Sam Cranage? <laughs> to yeah. Rip down. <laughs> Tez has picked like a random grid quiz game and Paddy Dow pops Paddy up. Dow st- Paddy Dow is included uh, in Yeah, so game. the first one is Carlton St. Kilda. Sam C R A Cranage. Okay. I'll get it. Yeah, you got it. Oh, that's elite by you. So, <laughs> what the fuck? So, what this means is only 0.65% of people have picked Sam Cranage. The aim of the game is to have your rarity score as low as possible by picking the most obscure player. So, obviously, Paddy Dow teammate and someone that also played a game for Carlton, you're not going to go Crips because it's just such a popular yeah, name. Yeah. You get me? Oh, wait a second. Hang on, hang on. So, what's with the St. Kilda thing? Okay, so, like, so in, in this one here, for example, we have to have a player that played at least one game for St. Kilda and... Played in the 2010s. Any player from the 2010 lineup, as in from in the 20, 2010s. Played between 2010 to 2019. And yeah, that played for St Kilda. At least one game for St Kilda. Yep. And the more random, the better. Oh fuck! That's the that's the name of the game. Oh, okay, I get it. Yeah, me. So, so why? So is- then, this bottom one here, for example, Paddy Dow, a player that played it, a, a game with Paddy Dow and played at least one game for Carlton. Um, oh, okay, so and the then next sh- one would be a top 10 national draft pick of Carlton and then a top 10 national draft pick that played in the 2010s. Correct. Yep. And to- oh, okay, cool. Top 10 national draft pick that had 30 plus disposals in a game. Yeah. Get me? Oh, okay, I got it. But so pick let's any, pick the next any one, one of your rapists. The next one. Let's start here. Okay. Pick any one of your rapists from this. Oh, wow. <laughs> like, like James Gwilt? <laughs> Not that he's a rapist, but like <laughs> as a name, that's a random name. Yeah, that's a random name. <laughs> Sorry, I just used James Gwilt. <laughs> well, the word rapes come up in this. Uh, <laughs> just calm <laughs> down a bit. <laughs> uh, what are we doing? Playing in the 2010s for the Saints. What's an obscure one? Obscure as fuck, like Jason Graham. So, okay. How do they go by judging the obscurity of it, just as in, like, stats? Number of people that... No, no, oh, this is actually, live. Number of people that actually picked those players. Yes. Oh, fuck. I, like I said, my general knowledge is pretty shit, so... I mean, someone's played, like, minutes. just a couple of games. <laughs> I feel like a lot of people go him. I feel... You're probably the best person for this game, man. Every now and then, like, we'll be having a footy chat, and you'll bring up some name... <laughs> I'm like, who the fuck was that? He's like, oh, terrible player from like the yeah. 90s. I'm like, who? Yeah. And then you tell me to, you usually tell me to get on YouTube or something and find yeah. them. And it's just like some spud. That's like, my wheelhouse though, like the 90s and 2000s. Yeah. And then after that, I kind of go off a bit. I wonder why. It was so shit. <laughs> Will is a random one that I yeah. put off. I mean, we could sit here all night. It's, no one's going to listen to Will. Yeah. Okay, so click James GW Quilt. Okay. What's considered a solid oh, Fuck, I forgot score. he went to Essendon. You get less than 2%. 2%'s like, 2% like yeah. you're good. I, does it have to be obscure? Oh, oh nice. Oh. Nice. Really? Yeah. He did it for St. Kilda, though. When? 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 A top 10 draft pick that played at least one game for Carlton. So I've got Murray Vance in my head. Oh, <laughs> yes. And I think he was like pick six or something. And he was no good, but Who he was, was highly Murray good. Murray Vance? 
<laughs> you exactly. see what I mean? Exactly. <laughs> Locky my- Plowman was pick nine. Is he really? Yeah. Is he more obscure than Vance? No, I don't no, I'll go so. Vance. Go Vance. Vance? Murray Vance. Murray. Oh, oh, very good. Very good. I All wonder right. what see, but now I want to know what Plowman would have been. Have a top ten draft pick. <laughs> <laughs> a top ten draft pick that played in the twenty tens. Um fuck. Yeah, okay. And this is for any team. Any team. So you could still go Plowman. When was David Spriggs? Was he before that? Well, he was, yeah, he was before that. Game. He was before that. Oh, okay, yeah. Lockie Plowman was a top 10 draft pick. Okay, the March Bank. Oh, we Jared could try Pickett. it now. Look, want to go well, Plowman? he was Plowman, yeah. Yeah. Playing the 2010s, played in 2019. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. oh, <laughs> 0. 0.56. 0. <laughs> it's like, who? He's all over the, like, the latest <laughs> AFL use. No yeah, one knows. Yeah. No one cares. <laughs> Top 10 draft pick that had a 30 disposal game. Mark Murphy. Oh, so this is any top 10 draft pick. Any top 10 draft pick. You reckon O'Brien ever hit 30? No way. Nah. Nah. Dow would have. No way. Nah. Dow, you don't reckon he hit 30? Dow never hit 30. hit 30. Didn't he? Never. No. Never. Yeah, it was okay. only like 25. Oh! Samo. He had one 30 plus game against the Dogs. Had 35, 25 at half time. Samo Seaton. Samo Seaton. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Type in. Wait a second. Petrovsky. Petrovsky Seaton was a top 10 draft pick. Yeah. yeah it was pick five, six. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. What the fuck have we yeah. been doing? Yeah, I know, mate. I know. This is like the graveyard mate, of like. We could be onto something here. Type in Petrovsky. <laughs> you know, no, he had one game over 30, I reckon. Oh, all right. Oh, all right. Oh, 1%. That's, that's that. solid. That's solid. Yeah. All right. Pat it out, team, mate. So a this team is ma- sad, man. Yeah. Like, this is a sad lineup. Doesn't so, he look good, though? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, Pat, a guy so, that played with Paddy Dow at least one game with him in the same team, and obviously, for, so it's it's only going to be for Carlton. It's got to be like it, it's got to be. Did Dow get drafted? Twenty seventeen. It can't be, it can't be AFL okay. level. Yeah, it's got to be AFL. Yeah. Okay. I'm going like Cam O'Shea, Aaron Mullet, these types. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You know? Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but hang on, when did Aaron Mullet leave? <laughs> Aaron Mullet played for the club in 2018 for sure. That was Paddy's first year. And did Dow play much in his first year? Yeah, he played nearly every game. Did he? Yeah, yeah. 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 Like bulk games into Paddy Dow. Yeah, okay. That was the point. The fact that he got so many games and he'd never proved himself like as in... Correct. You're a great VFL player. You're not... A, you're Do an okay... I love what we're doing with Jackson Binns. Yeah. Yeah, fuck. I'm excited for him too. Arguably probably could have yeah. played a game this year. Yeah. But like, make him, make him earn it a little bit. Yeah. Don't just gift these people games. Yeah. Like, yeah, you're 19. Here. Take the big Even wheel. Kemp went through it a bit. They yeah. waited. Yeah. You know? Big time, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> Shit. Listen, this is... We're on the right track. <laughs> like, we could do something special here. This is mediocre. I like um, uh, Mullet. Aaron Mullet? Yeah, like Mullet. <laughs> okay. Let's just... All right, let's go. Yeah. Mullet. Okay. Jared Pickett, Aaron Mullet. Let's go. Uh, oh, oh, very good. Oh, oh. Wow. I don't even know who the fuck that is, man. So he wore in 2010. Yes. Yeah. He wore 18 before Sam Walsh. So a Paddy Dow teammate. So when did Bauer retire? Paul Bauer? Yeah. Like 2010. It would have yeah, been a long then, time ago. Yeah. Oh, I played 2010. I reckon, yeah, it had maybe to have been 2010. He was like end of just before Jordan Russell era sort of thing. Oh, years after. Played in the 2010s and played a game with Paddy Dow. So I'm thinking like Andreas Everett. Did I he- liked Everett. No, he was well, gone by then. Yeah, I gone think he's gone then. by then. Liam Jones, Tom Williamson. <gasps> Great call. Great call. Tom Williamson. Oh, oh mate, nice. yo! If you get under ten, it's like my my record here on this is like fifteen. Yeah. Okay. This is ridiculous. These no, these faces like literally mean nothing to me, man. Thirty plus. I remember Williamson Mullet. I don't remember for the fucking life of me. I feel like this is where we should have put Samo, but that's yeah. okay. Yeah. Or well, Paddy Dow teammate that had, has had a third Wait, position. Well, this is better because there's fucking heaps. But we just got to get a... Wait, th- you can't pick, him, pick the same player again? the same one, no. Okay. Uh, 30 plus. Sam Kerridge? Was he with us in 2018? No. No, I reckon he was... Gonna- well, type it in and see what... Can you... Is that uh, yeah, shady? true, true. No, no, you can see when he played. 
2018. 2018. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? Um, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Just the 30... It's just going to be a teammate that had 30 touches. Yeah. In his career. It doesn't have to have been for Carlton. And I know he's had a 30-possession game. He had that sick... That, that game. That, yeah. He had a couple. I think he had a couple. Hang on, hang on. I'm trying to think of all the... Okay. Gibbs, Murphy, Judd. I'm thinking of Carlton. Judd. Yeah. This is the Judd. problem with Carlton. We've got so many players that have come in, razzle-dazzled us for like one week or two, and we've just jumped on the bandwagon of like, this is the mis- this is the prodigal son? Yeah. We've got it. Because we won't cling to anything because we had yeah, nothing, nothing for so long. That's what I'm saying. There might be... Carriage is a good pick. There might be someone more Stewart, obscure. Stewart, Chera, Newman. Yeah, but they're not obscure. Carriage is a more obscure name. I yeah. feel like... Simo? Yeah, most people probably yeah, wouldn't Simo. think of Simo. Murphy, Gibbs... But they're not obscure. Not obscure. Simo probably has been forgotten from people's memories. Carriage, I reckon, would be up there. He had 30 touches. When really? he played for uh, Adelaide, I think. Okay, so not, not a car. Right, <laughs> let's do it. Let's get Carriage. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh! Boom. <laughs> That's solid. Hey! That is solid. Do you see? That's- 9.08... <laughs> Is the re- is the score? Yeah, I need to send that to Blake. And, love uh, that. Blake plays. <laughs> yeah, mate. That's our first. That's our first official. Yeah. Um, <laughs> look at that. That's, that's real good. good. That's a good score. Hey, that's real good. That's insane. Yeah, man. How long have been playing this game? A couple of weeks. <laughs> couple of weeks. I do it live. Oh, you wait. I did oh, watch you do it live. Yeah, I do yeah. it live. I've added it to like show. People love it. The yeah, last. Yeah, yeah. It's just like what was that? 15, 10, 15, whatever that was. It's just like a little bit of, you know. Bit of fun, yeah. The last I better think than eighty three point eight that I saw. See, some your score the, is better than eighty three point eighty six. Yeah, grids. The last, like, some of the last content I saw you do was. Oh, one of these. nice! I like it. You can check the most popular picked. You know, that's a, that's shit. Yeah, but they're just, yeah. See, that, they would have all ruined us. Any of those picks. Yeah. My first, honestly, the only player I thought of for the first one was Aaron Hamill. That was the first one. Oh, yeah. mm. But then I thought it's too common. Like yeah. everyone would have. Yeah, like Phil Corcomelis, Murray Vance doesn't even have a pick. <laughs> So, Who's very fast? That's what you want. You love when they don't have a pig. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's obscure. <laughs> I've never heard of Murray yeah, Vance. Cool. Yeah. Um, oh, he would have probably played fucking, I reckon, three games. Let me check. There was a player years ago. I had a mate of mine. Who's, his old man used to be an ex-president of um, Hawthorne, actually. Yeah. And he sent me some link. He was talking about a player being shitter than someone from Carlton. I said, who? And he sent me a YouTube link. And he goes, this guy had one game, one or two games, and it was just turnover on turnover on turnover. And I could never remember the name of that player that he talked about. Too many that have come and gone. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I feel like it would have been like end of 2000, start of 2010s. Yeah. Maybe 2006, you know? Listen, at the end of the day, <laughs> five games, my events. The Blues, <laughs> pick six. Stay with me. <laughs> Pick six. Pick six. 99. Wow. 99 to 2001. That hurts. Six games. And what do you do after that? Five games, one goal, pick six. And then what? Nothing. No, no. When you say nothing, do you mean he got dropped and that was the end of his career? Yeah, went on to play for the Bendigo Bombers. Are you, BFL. You're kidding. Pick six. Who the fuck was that list manager in then? Uh, <laughs> was it Cole Sauce. Kinnear? was for a long time, wasn't it? Was it Cole Kinnear? Was that his name? I don't no. know. Who was before Sauce? We had, a, we had the same guy for a long time, I think. Don't know. Anyway. Oh, fuck. First selection, 98. Vance debuted the following year and played four senior games, but spent the majority of the season with the reserves, finishing second in the BNF. Another fucking gun VFL player. <laughs> <laughs> Bring him in as a halfback coach. Let him know, Steve. <laughs> let, let him know, bro. <laughs> <laughs> um, say it with me. What? The Blues are good. The blues are Say good. with me. Yeah, the Blues are good. Blues are, we we're, are good. We're good. Carlton we're good. are good. We're a very good time. Carlton are good again. They're good again. We're a very good team. I don't know. I don't feel... I don't think it's warranted yet. Like, what does it, What's it going to we'll, take for you? Come out next year and fucking dominate. Do it again. Not, yeah, we have to no, do it again. No, not, not have a lopsided season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not fade away in these bullshit games and lose by three goals. Top four all year. Dominate. Yeah. Fucking... I'll, I'll cop a loss by a kick if it was 
fucking nose to nose all game. You know what I mean? And there was just nothing. It was like you know you blink or sneeze and you've lost it. I'll cop that because at least I know they let it out on the field and I could see it. But when you you just just these rebounding goals, man, from turnovers from nothing. It's like what the fuck are they doing? <laughs> Yeah. It's frustrating, man. Yeah, I know, I know. Because you know they're better than that. Well, this is. I'm curious to see how we go next year when we have undoubtedly a patch. Every team has the patch. Three, mm. four weeks. You either lose all four, or you lose two or four, or you like mitigate. It's coming. Yeah. Our fans. I'm curious to see how we go. When we lose two in a row, three in a row. I think the landscape's changed a bit too because there's been a lot of like retirements or like you know trades and. Teams that you thought would dominate this year didn't, who traditionally would dominate. A lot of people ch- just ch- I don't know. It's, no, I get what you're saying. Like it's weird, mate. Port have restocked. Sydney yeah. mm-hmm. going to go again. Yeah. Um, GWS going to be up. Like yeah. Collingwood's still going to be good. Yeah, they're not oh. be shit. You don't see him being shit just cause. See him winning it again, mate. Mm. They're that good. How many retirements did Richmond have? Yeah. So like they're moving into next next phase. Yeah. Do you reckon Timbers going to do anything? At Gold Coast? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I think so, yeah. I like their list. Yeah? Yeah, man. I like the players. I and think it was a cop-out for him to say, I'm, I'm done, I'm, I'm tired, oh, and then like six weeks later, fucking... It was a bit of theatre. Yeah. yeah. I think, well, he I think that's bullshit. I think I just tried to like make it, you know... No, nah, I, I think that's us. I don't think that that's... But this is what Carlton wasn't doing. What? Making the calls to get rid of the premiership. Like, we hold on to this sentiment. Mm-hmm. Richmond, when it's like when it's done, it's done. Hawthorne, great. Like when it's done, it's done. Gunston, oh yeah, mm. yeah. Did you see the idiots on the? Oh, tell me, you guys follow some of the Carlton socials on Facey? Uh, I don't follow Facebook. Yeah, I'm Facebook. I, I, I'm off Facebook. I, I, I have, post my videos and yeah, then like I stay you, away. You're like me, man. I've got Facey purely for my business and like podcast. I use it for marketplace. Yeah, and I use a, yeah. and I use a, a Duke Leverage account. I don't use my own one. Yeah. The only things I'm subscribed to is Carlton shit, right? Just for the sake of... Um, no, no, why are you so mad? Yeah. <laughs> Gunston. <laughs> They've all come out. All these idiot supporters. Oh, he'd slot right in. We could use a veteran and fucking blah, blah, blah. For, even fucking Hawthorne have come out saying, nah, mate, like you're done. Yeah, I like we, we don't want it. you. We've got Martin. Like we've got... Yeah. Yeah. I think we need to... We need... Maintain. Keep going with more young got. kids to keep the depth going. Yeah, Nick Gunston. Go to the draft, pick a couple. Or we trade up to get pick eight from Geelong. That's on my table. Um, pick it. But what would that involve? That involved future first, wouldn't it? Yeah, because maybe. Cu- we've got a couple of we've picks. We've only got 28, 20... 22, 28. Yeah. The deal for Hollands is like <sighs> unbelievable. What do you mean? Yeah. Oh, that, what we got. The way that we did it. Yeah, it was sneaky. Because out. like, yeah. That was out of the sauce playbook, fan. <laughs> So- nah, Sauce haggles, man. He haggles for ego. Yeah. He haggles for like, oh, what that last pick coming back? It's like, man, mm-hmm. you're, you're never, never going to use pick hundred and eight, mate. <laughs> yeah. Just fucking let it go. <laughs> like Dodoro, it's fucking painful. He was useless. I love Austin. Yeah, yeah. man, look at what he's brought to the club. Yeah, man. Uh, Hewitt, Chera, Acres, Lewis Young. Oh. Okay, we don't use him as much now, but yeah, damn, but he's not these shit players. Player. Yeah. You're gonna if you ca- if you came on because Correct. someone got injured, you're not being like, oh, yeah, man. fuck, you solid know? backup, yeah, yeah, great backup player. He's um, Sauce did okay in the first draft with Charlie Harry and that. Then his trading was actually not too bad for future picks. To, like, who did we get yeah, for yeah. practically free? Who was it? It was involved in like a do it. No, no, no. Gave him a future pick. It never got used. Before that, yeah, there was that one. Was that was it? That I think one? We've a couple of good ones. I feel like there was someone else. There was like an epic. Crisscross of players, and we basically got got him for yeah. free or got him for nothing. Actually, we got like five players for one. Was oh, that was with Plowman and that. Was it Gibbs going to Adelaide, or and we got two first rounders for Gibbs? One of them turned into Which was a massive win. De Koning, yeah, yeah, that was a huge win. Gibbs was past his prime. He was nothing when he went there. He had yeah. a he had a massive year for us. Yeah, that year I carried him off, bro. Went to Adelaide and nothing. Yeah, look, man, I like Gibbs. I think he copped a lot of flack. Yeah, no, I agree. Wait, when <laughs> <laughs> didn't fulfill his potential, in my opinion. No, I don't think he did. Yeah, yeah. I don't think he did fulfill his potential. I hated the club for cheering him off. I yeah. hated this sort the sight of it. Yeah. I thought it was like a death. I still think it's yeah. I like. I really the death, no, that, I, that was it. Love Gibbsy, respect and all of that. I hated the sight of 
everything it represented. Mm. We are dog shit. <laughs> and we're fucking... Uh, we're dog shit. <laughs> we, are we were. Dog shit. We were. Not pulling any punches tonight. We were dog shit. Yeah. When was that? What year was it? 2021. Was it? 2020, round 17, sorry. I it was, yeah, I was going to say, um, I'm pretty sure it was like lockdown era. Because it was already dismal, like, just watching the shit. So, <laughs> pick 21. Sorry, we traded out Tom Bell and pick 41 to Brisbane. And we got pick 21, which we used in a trade for pick 11, which we took Charlie Kerno with. Mm. <laughs> That's a good one. Tom um, Bell. Tom Bell. Oh, the Lockie Henderson one. Remember how that happened when he left? Yeah. Yeah, and his mum got on the radio saying, leave Lockie alone. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at me? We got... What are you thinking? You just spontaneously laughed. We got a future first round Was pick. Was I wrong? <laughs> no, I'm laughing because like, I remember the whole furor I fucking it. hate Lockie Henderson. He's such a pretender. That's also why I was laughing. Yeah. <laughs> Lockie Henderson is one of the biggest pretenders of wow. all time. Wow. That's just... Fuck off. Yeah. He's... he's no. Nah. Sorry. Did he win a flag? Yeah. No. No. What, did he get... No, I thought he did. Uh, I don't think so. I thought he did, man. Nah, because they won in 11. No, yeah, 11, and then last year. Did they win between that, did they? No, nah, because Scott's their last two... No, he didn't. He didn't play any flag. Why do I th- well, we got Harry Mackay for him. Yeah, that's good. For Lockie Henderson. We got, a, we got traded a future first-round pick for Lockie Henderson... And then we traded it in a deal, and we got Harry Mackay. Yeah, what a swindle. That was good. <laughs> in der Swindler. <laughs> <laughs> swindler. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck me, man. All right, so what do you reckon Carlton's needing in order to, like, patch up this shit, all the in- inconsistencies, etc.? I mean, you look at our squad... <laughs> I think what happened in the second half of the year is what they needed. <laughs> yeah, but like, stock-wise, do you reckon we still need someone? No, I don't think so. I think, think we've got every base covered. Yeah. That's I what think, I, I think what we're talking like, about, that link of... You're laughing at me again. <laughs> the link like of forward saying, and mid. You're making it out like I'm just, oh, they're um, shit, um, they're going to always be shit. No, mate, we've had years of years of doing this. What I'm and saying I just, is... Um, I'm just loving to see you come into this happy place with, yeah. <laughs> with the club. It's my fucking place, mate. <laughs> yeah. No, no, what I'm asking is, like, we've been patching, like, slowly, slowly, we've been culling the shit, you know, burning the dead wood. What I'm saying is, is there anyone else we need now moving forward? Or once, are we just banking now on people to get healthy and get yeah. a solid preseason? I think that's so. a big thing. I think yeah. the UK's still got, um, you know, improvement. Yeah. Do you reckon our, um, our ruck situation's manageable now with TDK? Yeah, I think yeah, he's, I think he's ready. ready. He's ready yeah, to take on more responsibility. Ready. You reckon? Yeah, I think so. His yeah. final series, for, I wasn't sold, but his final series, I was like... Final, yeah, I wasn't sold yeah. at all. So. He looks no, like... No, same. It was only the, the Melbourne game, really. But him... Yeah. Oh, no, he was good in Sydney. He was good against Sydney. Every time he took a mark, people I was with were like, hey, he took a quarter to get, Tim. you got to be happy. Like, every time. And I would stand up clapping. I'm like, Aah! you know. But that's what I'm... The only thing that concerns me about the whole lineup is probably the ruck, man. I don't know why. Like, I like Pitto. They always take longer to come on. Yeah. And I think TDK looks ready. Like, he's probably, what, coming into his fourth year Seventh. or something, is he? Seventh year? Mm. Oh, he my was, God. He was- <laughs> <laughs> Seventh year? <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> really? <laughs> wow. That's what I was counting. So, he was in the 2017 <laughs> draft. He was picked after O'Brien. He was, like, pick 27 or pick 30, something like that. <laughs> Right. He's, so he's past coming on. He's, do you know what I've <laughs> Do you know what I've noticed that we do with the list management strategy? So what we do is we keep tabs on each draft and we go back for players after the draft is done and we know who actually became good. So for example, mm. we didn't draft pa- we didn't draft Adam Chera in the Paddy Dow draft. We now go have Chera. Mm. Um, oh, so like you once, get me? Once the cards play, we don't just put them away. We leave them there. As in, we go and target players from two, three drafts prior. Yeah. Like Elijah Holland's another example. Yeah. Um, 
2020, who do we draw? So the Tinder, the Tinder requests just stay there. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> they disappear. Yeah, they come back. And then when you, we, pause account. Like, hey, Sos, Sos wakes up pause. in the middle of the night just scratching. He's like, uh, he gets his phone out. Hey, you up? <laughs> what no. are you doing? WYD? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, I've got to turn that into. A, I've got to make a meme out of that now for sure. One hundred percent. I'm going to. Uh, the Doro is sitting there with his lotion by his bedside table. <laughs> I haven't done a Photoshop for this podcast in a long time. I've got it now. Done. <laughs> Sauce in bed with his phone. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fuck. Okay. <laughs> it's good to be happy, boys. Yeah. Uh, seriously. It's good to be a good one. I think, yeah, I think my the biggest <laughs> biggest liability, which is a good thing to say if it's the only liability we have, is the ruck. Pito is a, is a certain type of ruckman. Do you know what I mean? He's not an all... Like, he can't do anything else, but yeah. ruck. Do you know what I mean? Like, as in... He's a tap ruckman. Cruz, Cruz would take a mark and kick a goal. You mm. know? Like, you could count on him for that sort of shit, but... Pito isn't that athletic. Type. No, he's not. He's big. Have you yeah. ever stood next to Pito? Mm-hmm. How big is he? Like, I mean, because you're, you're a big bloke, like a tall, yeah, he's broad. Boy, he's big, but he's fit. Like, he's, he's strong. Yeah. He's strong. He looks like a unit. He's strong. He's like a man. He, he could be like a bouncer. Plays like a man, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Such a nice guy. Is he? You speak to him, he opens his mouth. He's just like so gentle and yeah, really good guy. Okay. What do you reckon? Where do you reckon now? You reckon it's just a matter of keeping everyone healthy? Yeah, I think there's improvement in the players we've got, and I think, but I think, like Elijah Holland's, like that link midfield forward, I think is good. Is yeah. like something we really needed. If Martin and um, Cunningham are fit and available, there's not as much of an issue. Mm. The issue is we just don't have a half forward third. Just the Elijah Holland's yeah, idea. Yeah. yeah. Paddy Gow couldn't do it. Wait, mm-hmm. what do you mean a half forward third? Oh, as third in- goal, third like option, you know, like at half forward. Yeah, guy that can. Okay, that prototype half so forward, like let's, you know, the guy that can go in the midfield. And let's can also- do what we had done a while back. Yeah, and make the list Oof. for next year. Who would be where, and who would be on the outs? Who would be on the ins? And can I just borrow that mouse for a second? You mean like the best twenty-two? Yeah, the best twenty-two. Where you'd play them? What are you looking for? Pipe in. Oh. Zero hanger. Zero hanger. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> you laughed. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What's going on here? <laughs> what have you done? You up? Just with the you go. <laughs> All right. Full back. That's Jacob Weedering. Yep. Agreed? Yeah. Agreed. 100%. Okay. Uh, so the half back, is that Marchbank? Um, yeah, probably Marchbank. Is he like McGovern, one and two? I was going to put McGovern on like a, a flank. Yeah, okay. Where's McGovern played mostly? Is it I think normally gets made in the flank? pocket, doesn't he? Yeah, he gets made in the pocket or, yeah. yeah. So like Caleb Marchie. Um, Mabruk, Saad. Yep. Yeah. The pocket or... Saad, man. We didn't even talk about yeah, Saad this year. Well, I How think you'd f- have Saad on one and Williams on the other. True. Back flank. Oh, true. It's sex, mate. <laughs> um, Saad. Saad is, is a gun, man. And uh, yeah. Zach... See how he gave that, the speech at the end of uh, that game, man? Yeah, I was just like, fuck. Um, who else? Newman? Back line. Yeah. Uh, half back. Um, yeah. 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 Newman and Boyd. Uh, not Boyd. Uh, Kemp. Yeah. Kemp or Doc? Yeah, Kemp. Wingers, is this just Acres and Hollands? Or is it Acres yeah. and Doc? Yeah, I think Acres and Doc and probably Hollands on the Doc. bench, maybe. Yeah. Acres, Doc and Hollands. Hollands probably on the bench. Hollands on the bench, yeah, 100%. Super sub. Put Crips in the middle in the sea? Yep. yep. where it gets interesting. So we'll go, what, Charlie full forward, Harry half forward? Uh, yeah. That's how it's been all year, hasn't it? I don't like, yeah. Yeah. 
Although, I think it's ready to, we're ready to unleash Charlie into the midfield. You reckon? Cooter. Just don't think. <laughs> <laughs> just, I just don't trust McKay to hold it down. Yeah, that's such a fair point. You reckon? Yeah, I don't. Why? He's too far his, in his head. His form doesn't suggest that he can. Oh, this is fucking tough. It's going to uh, get tough. Motlop. Motlop in the pocket. Yeah. Little doc, little, um, little Motlop. I think... So we're going to put Elijah Hollands. He might not be there, but I'd say Elijah Hollands on... You reckon he's already in? Maybe the, oh, he's there. What? Walking, he's right there. But what? Walking straight on? I don't know if he walks straight on. Really? That's a big call. Maybe not. Yeah. We'll see. What's we'll, the age we'll, difference between them? Elijah's 21. Okay. Um, Jack Martin, half forward? Yeah, Martin, yeah. Martin, yeah. I'm just trying to get, like, the, the locks. Oh, he's... Oh, wow, wow, I was going to say, wow, I love how we skipped over Kennedy... No, we haven't. We yeah. haven't. We still got the bench to do, but then yeah, yeah, no, but like, as in, it didn't even come up. Um, a year ago, you were talking about how Kenny was like the best player we have. Did was I? And I don't I said, know if, if anyone was saying that. Yeah, you did on you the first. The best yourself, player on the first <laughs> episode, we actually did. <laughs> it's a big call. Cool. I was the one yeah. that said that Kennedy was another pretender who just did a few flash in the pan moves and got himself another contract. Mm. Then the start of last year, I saw Kennedy do all the things that he did, and I was like, "Wow, didn't expect that at all." I'm surprised. Uh, after, Mate, I remember this shit. <laughs> just, um, I've listened to many, many hours of our podcast, boys. So we've got Owies, Durden, oh, Silvani, Fogarty. Oh, fuck. What a list. You might, you may be right. Sauce. You may be right in putting Elijah or... Oh, I would have a lot. Well, or Elijah's. is this Matt Cottrell? Uh, so this is a good problem to have, man. Mm-hmm. Very yeah, good problem. Coach was either there or starting bench. Yeah, I mean, I think oh. he's done enough. Is it Cunningham? Yeah, possibly. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Go back to the list. Let's just see who we may have forgotten. No, we're, no, we we going by position. Yeah, I know. But that's but what like, I'm this doesn't like just in case. Some, you know what I'm saying? Like a name. Jackson Bins as well could be coming in. Fuck, the just in case there. there's a name, man. Got some good depth coming. I think it's Cottrell yeah. in the half forward. Yeah, or Cunners. <sighs> well, hey, one of them's going to be on the bench. Let's go Cottrell. They, yeah. I think Cottrell's earned a place in the, in the best 22. Yeah, yeah that's, he's, I agree. He's been consistent I agree. enough, man. Like he's, yeah. Is Jack Silvani playing in our best 22? If, if not uh, him, then who? Let's leave this forward pocket free for a sec because oh, yeah. we're going to pick a ruck. Are we going to do two rucks? TDK start, I would say TDK. Yeah. All right. Chero. Chero Hewitt. Walsh. Oh, Walsh. Wow. See again, Walsh. We forgot about Walsh. Wow, bro. <laughs> um, <laughs> all right. You know? It's change. Hollands, Hollands. Double Dutch. <laughs> Do you have always in the team? I think you have to. Always, I yeah. Wait. I like always, yeah. I can't wait for Jordan. the commentators to coin the phrase the Dutch oven. <laughs> I want some form in the link up. No, <laughs> <laughs> like Hollands to Hollands, it's a Dutch oven. Where's McGovern, <laughs> mate? Kemp's on the bench. Where's McGovern, mate? McGovern, get in here, son. Itch. <laughs> Itch. So we're gonna go Kempy. Where did you put McGovern? Half back flank, mate. Okay. Kemp. So then oh, we got. Sa- Wait, no, no Sars there. Sorry, Sars never, mind. Never, yeah. never mind. I'm just having a bit of an episode. <laughs> an episode. Kemp, are we playing two rucks? Kemp. Yeah, I think so. Pitto. Camp Pitto. Hard, ma'am. Yeah, it is. So then we've got... We've got to get Cunningham in, in the team. Cunningham, yeah. Durden. Always, always Hewitt. Durden, Hewitt, Jack, Motlop, none of them. Jack Hewitt's playing. Sorry, Hewitt's playing. Surely. Yeah, I think so. George Hewitt. Problem to have. What? So then you've got both the Hollands. We haven't put the Hollands in. Haven't put one of them in. <laughs> <laughs> I would. I would. I would swap... Hang on, yeah. you, you got Blakers in there at the back, yeah? Yeah, Akers on the wing. On the wing. Yeah, okay, cool. I'd probably have Hewitt for Ollie for... Ollie for Hewitt? Ollie for George Hewitt, I think. It's hard. Who's the other... Unless Ollie... Or do we not have... Would Kemp not make it? Are we too tall? Maybe. Jack that's, Williams is that's like... That's insane. Yeah, man. Jackson Bins too is going to be really pushing. Yep. It's hard. Yeah. Wait, so you're confident on, on Owies and um, Motlop? 
Motlop, yes. Always, always good. I mean, he kicked the most goals out of all the forwards, the smalls. Yeah. Kicked 27. Outside yeah. of finals, he was there for the rest of the season. How old's always? 25, 26. Are you kidding? Mate, he's a, he's a great story. Mm. He's a basketballer. Mm. We, we, we didn't... Like, we got him for nothing. He hasn't been on the senior list for years. Yeah, now he's a category now he B is. rookie, I think. Yeah. Start. Great story for development, man. Um, I don't know, man. Like, is in Cunningham. Ollie Hollands. We haven't got Ollie Hollands. Ollie Hollands. Hollands. He's got to be in. Okay. Oh, yeah. So then look who's missing from that list, man. Hewitt and Kemp are probably the question marks for me. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Um, Kemp over Hewitt. Uh, Hewitt over Kemp, would you say? Or the other way around? I think if it's too tall, Kemp probably misses for, you know, maybe Chincotta. Oh, they're the same. No. Hollands. Jack Silvani. Silvani. Bins. I mean, Bins hasn't played a game, but he's... Fuck, it looks likely. I don't think they'd play a team with Teddy K. Pitto and Silvani. Will they? Have we done that? Yeah, it doesn't work. Yeah. It doesn't work well. No. No. Too tall. Everyone's talking about Murkoff for Could a while. Kennedy. Yeah, he trained with us and then went to Collingwood. <laughs> oh, Luke Murkoff? Yeah. Oh, sorry, you know, you're talking about the Ruckman. Yeah. Murkoff, yeah. Murkoff, sorry. Ruckman, yeah. I don't know who, yeah. Why well, everyone was talking about him like it was going to be like... He got injured late in the year. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What kind of player is he? I don't even remember him. I think he's oh, an <coughs> athletic Ruckman. <laughs> tall athletic. Yeah, tall athletic. <laughs> Runs all day. <laughs> So then, who are we missing? Like, as in, who are the questions? Fuck Kennedy as well, yeah. Um, so, yeah, Hollands, Silvani. Who would have been an in that's now, like, in J- Jason's is probably the biggest one there, the, the assumed position. That's depth, man. That's depth. Yeah, we've got some good depth. That's depth, baby. Looking good. Yeah, man. Top four. <laughs> Probably two. All right. I should probably get. I should probably write this list down. When you guys uh, nick off, I'm going to write it all down and put it aside, and just see where it pans out. Round one, yeah, be yeah. interesting. To Round see. one to see how they where they, which direction they go, and then halfway through the season, we'll do another another one to see where it's padded up. Matt Duffy, who's that? Oh, one of the Irish boys. Oh, that's right. Yeah. yeah. Who'd um, you just change Cunningham over from? New uh, Kennedy. Kennedy. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I don't think they'll play Kennedy and Hewitt. Yeah, I agree. Oh. Fuck. I think Hewitt's... Yeah, I think Elijah could be that spot. Who do you reckon is going to be the biggest team next year? Like we said this before, we said Collingwood's not going to get shit. Sydney's restocked. Carlton. <laughs> Who's going to be the big what? The big teams to watch next year. Gold Coast. Yeah. Yeah. I think Sydney will improve. That Gordon's a gun. I didn't... I've, fuck. Hey, that's the one you want across I've never really forward. seen him until that Carlton Sydney game. Star, mate. He's a superstar. He's 21. Yeah, yeah he is seriously good. Like Walsh good. Yeah. Like stratosphere. Really? He turned that He's game. that good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he turned that, that game against kicks us. Kicks goals, gets, gets 35, like... Yeah. Yeah. See, so Essendon load up with all this shit again. Remind me of us a couple of years back. Yeah. I don't want to laugh too hard at them because they're going to fig- they're going to like they're going to figure it out. Yeah. Everyone figures it out eventually. Um, but yeah, I believe you got me cool late. Yeah, man. Sorry, I have four. <laughs> a guy sent a guy got them sent to me. I have got four sachets. I have three now. <laughs> um, <laughs> so that's you. You'll know. You just let me know when you use it. You'll know when to use it. I'll, I'll be sitting here. It'll be on fan cams. Uh- Oh, so that's a, yeah. <laughs> blue lips. I'll, I will draw. Yeah, whatever. Are you up? <laughs> <laughs> whatever, whatever clicks it over, I'll come down here and pour a glass, and um. I'll get on fan cams. Yeah, or I'll send you the photo. One of the two. Who do you reckon out of Victorian teams? Do you reckon there'll be a reshuffle? Another reshuffle? What do you mean? The top like Victorian teams, man. I think Hawthorne will come up quicker than what most. Yeah, they've, do you reckon? Good, strong club. They've got yeah. their fucking right coach. They just they don't dwindle to the bottom yeah. too long. Yeah. Saints, they're primed. Not a believer. Oh, I don't know. I think they're shit. 
They're fucking terrible. Yeah. I'm sorry. I can't take eight, them seriously. Ninth. Would love to. And every time we lose to them, I, like, I get bitter about it for a long, long time. Yeah. Yes, and then I'll cop it. Collingwood, I'll cop it. Yeah, whatever. Saints, it's just like, nah. Yeah, that's the most annoying thing, because I don't rate them. I nah. don't rate them at all. And we never, fucking I've never can never beat them. them. Never. Yeah. Even when they've had, like, gun players that you'd like to have on your team, you wouldn't rate the rest of the team. The synergy's not there. The belief. Um... I think that's it. I think we're done. Yeah. I think Fucking we're done. hell. Top four, you say? Boys. Yeah, I think so. It's been a pleasure. It's been <laughs> fun. It's been good. It's good to do a... Uh, Thank goodness. A good, a fun podcast. Mashallah. <laughs> I, seriously, this year, man, I've said it to, like, everyone, anyone that wants to talk footy, I've said, anyone that's had something to say about Carlton, it's like, mate, we've got record membership numbers across the board, even in shittest games ever. We still had Carlton uh, fans coming out, mm. and it's and you know what, Carlton coming having this story that they had has buoyed like belief in the AFL as as entertainment as like a system. It got numbers back, man. Like yeah. it got the game exciting again. How many Friday night games? Oh, that's a good question. Next year, it's mm-hmm. got to be five. Yeah, they have to load us up again once they get over Sydney. Uh, the Sydney expansion that they want to do, yeah, five. Play Collingwood twice. Yeah. Play the Bombers twice. You have to. Like, you play Richmond once, I can feel it. I can I can smell Collingwood and Essendon twice. Mm. Yeah. I see it already. That That's standard, man. Like, it happens every year. Yeah. Yeah. They would, especially after the numbers this year. You'd be stupid not to. And then they do something like have two two games in Sydney. They won't give us West Coast twice. <laughs> you know? No, not after finishing eighth. No. Ah, oh, sorry. In the top eight. No. Yeah. <laughs> West Coast. No. Easy kills. <laughs> I'll easy. give Collingwood West Coast twice. The easy <laughs> Who's going to be the breakout player player to watch for next year? Out of Carlton? Yeah, on, on record. Um, breakout player. Player to watch for next year that's going to make the jump. <clears throat> I was going to say Zach Williams, but he's somewhat proven. So, oh, the, TDK. I think he's ready. You reckon? Yeah, I think he's ready. Out of March Bank, all Australian. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> I like that. Why is that funny? <laughs> it's funny. He's a fucking gun, man. I, I don't it. think you rate him. I no, think no, no, in no. the chat, he's often like, fucking Marchbank, man. Marchbank, fucking Marchbank. No, no, no. It's, I, I, it's not that I don't rate him. I know he's a gun and he's just copped injuries, man. Like, like I feel it. bad for the guy. You're often shit canning him. Fuck off, dickhead. You are. <laughs> no. <laughs> you are. He's if just... I had to shit can anyone, it was Plowman. No, nah, 100%. Marchbank. No, no, no. I think... TDK, I think, started coming into his own, like, especially in the final series, man. Like I, like I said, I never rated his marking abilities. And, yeah, just never... I, I, just say, I didn't say it was shit. I just wasn't sold on him. What he did in... If he keeps... If he carries on, carries over, then, yeah. I reckon Holland's will be fucking... Basically planting his foot in the, 20, in the top yeah. 20. Like 22. Like, as in, you can't... Undroppable. Yeah. No That's all you've got to do. Make yourself undroppable. Yeah. Mm. And to be that, like, young and... Still untested, but he has been tested. He's played finals now, and he gunned it, you know. Better win a bit more of the ball, but it'll come. Yeah, but it'll come. Exactly, yeah. yeah. I think that, I mean, looking at that list, that's insane. Mm. And, like, you, it, think about it. We had O'Brien, Dow, Fisher, these list cloggers that would have been there taking positions out of these guys. Now they're just an afterthought. Like, Do you think them. Fisher should have stayed and fought for a spot and made them pick him? I feel, go on the and easy. I don't know, but based off what I, the pieces, I think they were honest with him, and Voss was just like, like Fisher's not a Voss player. Mm. He's good, he's crafty, he's dexterity with his footwork, it's good, but you, you, like everyone who plays has to be like tough and like mm. brutal. Is that what you rate as a Voss player? Like I think so. Present. I think you can't have, a, you can't be, not to say Fisher's soft, flashy. but like, he's an, yeah, he's flashy, and mm. I think you need a bit of, Mate, we're in a prelim. Yeah, there's mate, no ground, great. Yeah. Like, You need to mm. win a one-on-one contest. Which is what's lacking from Harry. He's strong. You know? Harry's, Harry's not that player. He could be. Yeah. Built like that, it's Harry, a shame. Harry, just add the strength element to his... It's one preseason. Yeah. Deadlifting. Yeah. <laughs> he can become Tom Hawkins. When he size, can, yeah. like, have someone on his hip and, like, r- wrestle and mark, that's going to open up mm. everything for him. 
Yeah. And you that's know? why it's so surprising when you see him standing next to other players and just towering over mm. him. Also, he got in his head this year. Oh, big he time, had yeah. one better. I think Harry's... I actually think Harry's been good every year since he got into the team. And this was the one year where he just... Whatever, it all... Yeah. You know. But it's only one. Every other year he's been good. Mm. I want to see Weeders in the All-Australian. <clears throat> yeah. That, like... I want to see him do, like, no injuries, no fucking fade-outs, nothing. I think that's another one that'll happen. Yeah. I've, it'll this, come. this will come. 2024, he has yep. to. The body of work ends up taking over. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. Like, it's at that point now. It's like, no. He's elite. Me. He's elite. Yeah. yeah. It's um, just, I can't. Who's yours? Marshbank. Oh, that's right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Bank. yeah. What would you say? I like Durden as well. I think Durden's going to have a good year. Yeah. Um, I said Zach Williams, but... Yeah, but he's... You said TDK. He's, but he's established TDK, yeah. TDK. I Oscar think TDK Holmes. is going to burst, yeah. What do you reckon he's going to be leading the charge in? Just, like, influence on a game? Just kick more goals, maybe. Or just, like, slotting goals in? More reliable. Yeah, goals. Here's I think qu- just more presence around the Here's ground. Here's a question, and this will be for the mystery bin, right? I'll write it down when I write down the... Uh, <laughs> when I write down the list, yeah? Who do you reckon is not going to be at the team? Next year. Who's out of contract next year? I don't know. Well, a bunch of them got one year, didn't they? That's what I'm saying. Who do you reckon is going to be pushed out next year? Well, I think Fogarty, Cunningham, they've got to keep going on. Because they could easily fall out if they don't have a, se- a second half like they did last year. Uh, if they don't continue on from their second half of the season yeah. that they had, then, yeah. Okay. We can't invite. I want to see if it might show you like you. Oh, yeah. Oh, here you go. There you go, man. Yeah, man. man. He's got it. So. Ah, right. Aquay. Dom Aquay. Okay. Jordan Boyd. Jack Carroll. Jack Carroll. Fuck, I forgot about him. Cotter. Cottrell. Cunningham. Jack Carroll. Do we expect him to come on? Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You reckon? Yeah. Has to be next year. Yeah, it has to be, yeah. Well, Jack that, Martin. that Lemmy, Lemmy's got... Yeah, we signed him up. Yeah. him up. Mark Banks out of contract next year. Murkov. It's actually a pretty good list. <laughs> there's no big names. Seriously. What do you mean big names? Look, there's no, like, marquee player that's out of contract next year. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah nah. Nah, nah, they're loaded How up. many did McGovern get? This, this year was, like, the knuckle, the, knuck, the white knuckle ride, man. Like, fucking yes. TDK and, like, all these players. Yeah. Um, Dimmy. Thank you. For what? Having us, mate. It's been fun. <laughs> we appreciate you. We appreciate you uh, hosting us in your space. <laughs> we do. We're laughing. I'm giving you a problem. I'm giving you love. Uh, all right. I, I know, appreciate it. I can't take, take your... Compliments make him awkward. I don't make know. No, it's not that. It's so just... Do I have to be, like, ruthless again? <laughs> <laughs> You're a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> no, mate. This is great. We've done s- five, six... A preseason and a postseason for three years, no? Yeah, we lost one. And we lost. One. Oh, we lost yeah. one. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I, That's good. It's I think it's just nice to be nice. able to reflect and see this yeah. year and see everyone signed up. I, I think look forward to these nights. One more thing. All right, how about <laughs> this? Before we actually okay. leave, yeah. let's write down a question that we will answer the next time we come on the pod. Okay. <laughs> All right. I've got to think of my question. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that'll be preview 2024, right? Yeah. That's You're us. top or bottom? <laughs> we'll, 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 we'll do a mid-season one. We were here in the middle of the... Yeah, we're, middle of the yeah that was an emergency. That was like... Oh, yeah, because like, fuck. It was like, it was. <laughs> <laughs> you broke glass in case of emergencies. Like, man, we've got to get together. You're, no, to be fair, you were like, you were saying, I'm so morbid. I'm like, I don't know, talks. man. I don't know. He's like, just come. <laughs> let's... <laughs> it was. It was. It was. It it was. Like, the UN, yeah. the UN meeting, you know. Emergency board ball. meeting. Yeah, yeah. Um... <laughs> I want to ask myself in the preview, depending on what preseason looks like, uh-huh. I want to revisit the March Bank. Revisit. Yeah. March Bank All Australian conversation. <laughs> March Bank All Australian conversation. Okay. Don't know why, but. Okay. Do you know what I want to see? I want to see where Paddy Dow is. Preseason. Okay. Preseason and mid next year. Hey, down low next year. Download metal. <laughs> download. Mm. Download. We <laughs> should make download. The download. The download. Um, Watch him play well in his first game, and St Kilda supporters like just losing it. 
Yeah, like Stocker. Sure. Everyone lost it and said, oh, you'd be missing him Whoa. now. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah all right, man. <laughs> sure. You'd be missing SPS. Yeah, sure. Steve, okay. I'm not confident McKay gets over the yips. Ooh. Like, I'm more confident that he doesn't. Yeah, but you've been sitting there crying about it for the last two hours. Got it. Well, because there's upside. There's genuine upside, but I'm not convinced he can get over it. Okay, so Mackay and the yips. Yeah. We'll just revisit these mm. issues. And I hope I'm wrong. I feel Honestly. Like, I feel like we need another one of these. Especially now that we've gone through all this shit. All right. Got it. How many <laughs> How many wins next year? Oh. 16. 16? <laughs> what are you laughing at? I <laughs> know, oh, he tells us that we're laughing at him. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing at him. Everyone's just having a good time, I'm mate. laughing at the confidence. Because you full turned your body and you put your yeah. elbow up on the, on the table. You're like, 16. No, I what think, well, well, hang oh, on. What, what have we got? 24... I think we can win more than 16, but... I think more than 16, to yeah. be fair. I think, and uh, yeah. they may not be beltings. They might be ugly wins, but... Well, what, did, what, did, what did the top four teams have this year? 17. 17, yeah. I think okay. so. Well, I think we'll finish top four, so 17. <laughs> 16. It's funny, <laughs> man. It's because you turn... 16. It's like a suit on as well, like, yeah, 16. <laughs> well, in my professional opinion... <laughs> are you up? I've got, I'm delusional at the moment, we're three and a half hours in, and it's uh, 18 wins, Collingwood, 17 16, wins, Port four. Adelaide. 18, 18, 17, 17, 16. We're actually quite a bit away from the top four. We've got to win a couple more. It's because, look, like I said, we it's not that we got lucky, but we had luck on our side. Yeah, you own your luck. Yeah. Like, we, we did everything we could. Got to get to 15 wins, 16 wins. I don't think we will... We we clawed our way into the finals. We didn't have it easy. Mm, we yeah. gifted anything. We had to claw and fucking do everything we had in our arsenal. to Roll the dice. I don't think we'll have a nine-run loss patch again. Yeah. Nah. I think we'll win 18 games. Uh, I think we'll win 17 games Yeah, as well. I'm, I'm on 17. Saying, yeah. Yeah, okay. I, I'll cop 17. That'd be a great year. Who goes out? So, I think Saints go out. I mean, Melbourne. D- yeah, I think D's. In that... Okay, well, Melbourne hang on. Fr- who's, think- just out of the, who's just out of the eighth? Is anyone coming up from the, the bottom? Adelaide. Hawthorne, you'd think, would come up. Adelaide will go in, I reckon. Geelong won't. I'm not sure about Essendon. Oh, Gold Coast only won nine games. Yeah. I don't think Essendon will, man. Not yet. They'll oh, have no. a nice little run. Maybe a run. Well, yeah, they did. No, no. In the in, in halfway True, mark, were they like... <laughs> Got to be ready for it, boys. Yeah. I think Melbourne will drop out a little bit, fall down. Yeah. Culture. Yeah. Culture problem. Where did what's his name end up? Um, Jeff Harlett. Hold on. <laughs> Melbourne. <laughs> <laughs> Who? Who are you talking about? From Melbourne. It, he went to. Um, he left fucking Collingwood to go to Melbourne and then. How? Oh, Grundy. Grundy. Sydney. Grundy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Sydney. Sydney, yeah. Yeah, okay. How do you reckon he'll do it, Sydney? Yeah, okay, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I think okay. I, I, I hate it. I hate... He's a ruckman. He'll get played as a ruckman at, at Sydney, but at Melbourne, they wanted him to be a forward. Yeah. I don't, just I don't like him, but I, I can Why? respect his game. What's he done to you personally? Fuck off, dickhead. <laughs> he's, he's, what he, I, he, we're, we're at a garage sale and he picked up a lamp. That yeah, I no, fair enough. Yeah, what a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> what a dog. <laughs> Fucking wolf. A broken lamp. <laughs> <laughs> Grundy. <laughs> He, I went to grab it, he leaned down and grabbed it with his meaty paws. I said, Shit hey, bike. what the fuck? He said, it's mine. I'm like, oh, okay. Shit, bike. I'm moving to Sydney, I need this. He's <laughs> <laughs> got on his moving truck. It's a freaking lamp in the back <laughs> He just looks at it and laughs. Babe, what's that? Ah, oh, some little dickhead trying to get it. <laughs> All right. Uh, cool. That's well, that's us. what I'm saying. Anyway. Cool. Okay, so I've got the March Bank. AA conversation, the down low in the middle, Mackay and the Gibbs, <laughs> and how many wins? How that, many wins do you think? Build? No, no, I, I agree. I think more than I think 16. We're all on 17, I think 17. Yeah. I'm on, I've up to 17. I, I don't think we're going to get blown out like the way we did. Like, it's not yeah. going to be a lopsided season. Mm. Even, if, even if it is win one, lose one by a kick, win two, win one by like heaps, then lose one by a kick. You know, it won't be fucking inconsistent. Did Port make the finals last year? Last year? Yep, 22. They did. Yeah, they've gone out. They've gone out. Yeah. Top four. 
Were they top four last year? Were they? Port aren't a shit team, man. No, I don't think they are. Yeah. And that's what that's what pissed me off the most when everyone was hanging into Carlton saying, oh, they've done fucking good. Okay, mate, we beat the two teams that were impossible to beat. What more did you want us to do? Uh, we had some good wins. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. Cool. Cool. Good chat. See you next time. <laughs> Yalla. Hold up.